and this is our trailer. Um, come on with me. So here's the front of the trailer. Uh, it's a Jayco Designer. Um, I think it's a 2001. Um, comes with everything you can imagine. I'm just going to go around the outside first and then we'll go on the inside and try to show you what, what the deal is. Alright, so it's got three uh, slide outs. So you got the big one here. These are all pneumatically operated so you just press a button and they go in and out. Um, here's the uh, back obviously. Um, if you want to just give me the camera real quick, I'll show you the roof. Okay, so here's the roof. It's got a fresh new coating on it, no leak. Got a couple skylights, couple roof vents, other stuff like that. Okay. Okay. So we go over here. Here's your water cut out. So this controls. Come on over here. This controls all the things to, to you know, flush the system, run city water. It's got the diagram. It's in the manual as well. Um, you got your power for the trailer. That's 30 amp. Um, here's the other slide out. This is where the refrigerator and all that stuff is. Your heater. We got a hot and cold water water tap for you. There's an auxiliary shower, so you can have a shower outside if you want. This this comes out. Yeah. Uh, sewer ho sewer hose to, to pump out the, the the sewer tank. You got the connection under there. Here's an access panel into the under under storage under underneath the trailer. I'll show you that on the other side. This takes two dual uh, propane tanks on, on board. Those can operate the refrigerator um, and obviously your stove and obviously your heat. It's got a propane heater. Uh, I got the other tank too. Just haven't filled it up yet. Um, here's the other slide out. That's for the uh, uh, bed inside the bedroom. Um, under here you have space to put a generator if you want and you can actually that's integrated into the system so you can have a generator here and control it from the inside um, given obviously you buy, buy the right generator I think this is a fuel tank I've never had to use the generator so. here's the, there's an outlet outside and then here's your under storage can you get me? Tools in there. That's the you know the various things to open and lower the trailer and all that good stuff. All right, so let's go on inside. If you want to just take a quick uh, 360 and then and then I'll start explaining stuff. Kitchen, normal, obviously everyday kitchen. You got, um, you got your burners, oven, three burners, oven to small propane. You got a vent fan. Um, you got a microwave. Um, you got your AC, which you have your roof unit, so that's for the air conditioning, and it also operates your TV system. Okay, both of which work amazingly well. I guarantee you, they work very, very, very good. Um, so you got all that. Here's your control panel for um, all your different stuff. You got your water heater, uh, which is electric, but could also be gas, I believe. Um, you got, this is what I was talking about, the generator integration. You can use the, I don't have a generator. I never have, so I, I wouldn't know. Here's your, the specs for your, uh, your water pump, your batteries, and all that stuff. I didn't show you the batteries, but we got batteries. I just replaced those, actually. And then here's the control for the slide outs. Okay. Um, so if we go over here, here's the fridge. You have a fridge and freezer. Both work great. Um, these can, cool thing about these is they can work on your regular electric, so your 30 amp service, propane, and you can use them on the batteries. So, I mean, this thing 
will run no matter what. That's very good for being off the grid. You got all your cabinets and stuff. Lots of cabinet space. Uh, uh, integrated stereo system. So there's speakers all through the, the thing. And that is, you know, this all, the wiring goes in there for these individual speakers. Uh, I got a, that's a new smart TV. So it's got all the Netflix and everything that you can, um, which we call it to you, to it. Um, all right. So you got that, 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 um, all of your, all of your, you got your water pump in this back corner, and then you got all your power and your power converters all in there. Okay. And then you got some more storage up there. Um, lights, vent fans. These are pretty cool too. You got vent fans up here, which are controlled by a thermostat down here. So you can, um, it's a cool way to, to save not having to put the, the air conditioning on. It just turns them on and off based on the temperature. It's super cool. Um, on all the windows, have these cool like I don't even know what they're called honeycomb shades so you can do like partial light for privacy but then you can also block out light with those so that's pretty cool um, and those all work uh, you got some lamps that's obvious stuff. I mean set couch um, does this pull out this yeah pull? that's a sofa. so this is a pull out sofa as well which is really cool so you have another bed as well um, and then you can two recliners so that's really cool uh, we use that a bunch um, Fridge went all over that. AC. Yep, I think we went over all that. So if you want to come past me, you could do a little loop and then meet me back here. So if you do a little loop. Okay. So now in here, we didn't have it, but it actually, if you want to come in here and look, it actually has hookups for uh, a washer and dryer, like an RV washer and dryer. We never used it, but it's there if you want it. So that's pretty cool. We almost got one of those. Okay, over here you got your bathroom. Which is cool. Toilet, obviously, and a little cabinet above. Uh, also a fan up here, which is cool. A vent for all the nastiness. Okay, over here you got your shower. So you got shower head and also a tub, small tub with access as well. Okay. All right, over here. Obviously, this is also a cool little like linen basket, which is nice. Um, little outlet, obviously a mirror, little vanity thing. Over here is kind of cool too. This is like a little privacy thing. So if you got guests or something like that, you can close this off, and they can still use the bathroom. So that's quite cool. We use that a bunch too. Um, and then you got your bed, obviously. This is a queen size bed, and I think the one in there is a. It's a full. Okay. So I'm going to come over here and I'll show them the storage as well. There's also some storage under here, which is nice. So you got, it's not much, but it's enough to put some linens and stuff like that. So that's cool. Um, okay. So some drawers over here for your clothes, even more cabinets. There's tons of storage in this place. A little vanity kind of table. We never use that, but we usually just kept it down. But, um, and then you got your closet. Which is a nice, pretty nice size, mm. and then you got this side as well. So it's quite a lot of room with the closet. Mm. Uh, another one of those vent fans in here, and I think that may, I think that might be it. So thanks for watching. If you guys have any.